Hey guys, this is how you're going to do myotome assessment for the lower extremity. We'll start with the L's and, um, and we'll do uh, S1 and S2. Okay. So for L1, uh, we want to check the nerve innervation to the muscle and make sure they have good strength. So for L1 and L2, it's going to be up in this region for the hip flexors. So we're going to have them lift their leg up and you're going to stabilize at the hip and you're going to put some downward pressure on the knee and you're going to say hold and don't let me push you down okay so hold good and then you got to compare that bilaterally so lift this leg up hold and don't let me push you down good and the strength was the same on both sides so we would know that that was within normal limits so that was l1 and l2 for l3 we're going to have them in knee extension we're going to stabilize just proximal to the knee one hand will be on the ankle and we're going to push down so we'll say hold don't let me push you down he's got good strength there this one's the same way hold and don't let me push you down good so that was uh, L3 for L4 we're going to have them in dorsiflexion we're going to stabilize just above the ankle one hand on top of the foot and you'll say hold and don't let me push you down it's got good strength there. Same thing, compare bilaterally. Hold and don't let me push you down. Good. For L5, we're gonna do this on the great toe. So stabilize at the ankle, you can stabilize at the foot, either one is fine. The other hand is gonna be on the great toe. You're gonna have them in this uh, extended position. So take your toe up. Now hold and don't let me push you down. Good. Same on this side. Hold and don't let me push you down. Good. For S1, you're going to have them in uh, an everted position. So put them in the eversion and external rotation. Stabilize at the ankle. You want the one hand to be on the medial side of the ankle. The other is on the lateral side of the foot and you're going to be pushing them into inversion, you'll say hold them, don't let me push you in. Good. Compare bilaterally, hold them, don't let me push you in. And he's got good strength there, and that's S1. For S2, there's two ways to check it. We can stabilize the ankle, put one hand on the foot, you want them in plantar flex position, and you would say hold them, don't let me pull you up. Okay, so hold, good. Same position, hold and don't let me pull you up. And that's S2. Okay, the other way that you can check S2 is for knee flexion. So depending on what um, body part you're actually trying to really focus on, that would determine which one of these you use. But for S2 myotome, you can um, check knee flexion. So stabilize at the knee, hold them on the posterior aspect uh, of the lower leg right around the Achilles, and you'll say hold and don't let me pull you out. Okay. Same on the other side, hold and don't let me pull you out. And he's got good strength, uh, strength there. That would be a five out of five for him on all of those milestones. And that's it.